What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Max Set from AGS. Now before we get into this, if you did miss the last episode, there's a link to it in the description. I've also recently opened up a Discord for my community and I'm going to be hosting an event there on Saturday. So if you want to join, you can click the link in the description for that as well if you do have Discord. Anyway, today we have 39 mil to spend on upgrades after the profits of yesterday. Uh, you guys have suggested quite a few upgrades. I'm going to do some on my own. A lot of money to spend, but before we get our upgrades, I'm going to go get ourselves some NMZ points so I can view the Sears ring and imbue my mage cape real quick. Then we're going to go buy the upgrades and go out risking lots of money. Hope you guys do enjoy it. If you do, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you guys later. Right, we just killed the, what's it called? The thingy majiggy. And we now have our demon's heart, which means we can go and be our cape. Right, use the demon's heart. And we can now get our imbued cape. Now let's go get the points for an imbue ring, and that's when we'll buy our upgrades, and I'll let you guys know what we're buying. 39 mil to spend. I'm going to go buy all my upgrades now. First of all, I'm going to start with my tank gear, so the Serpentine Helm. After that, we want the Carol's top as our top, obviously. 2.3 mil that I'll buy for. Then we want the Torax, uh, Torax plate legs as the bottom. Then we obviously want Aram's for the mage. So an Aram's top for... 1.7 mil, Aram's robe skirt for 1.5 mil, oof, alright, we got a little bit of money back from that, uh, do I want to get a Fury yet, I don't know, I definitely want a Dragon Fire shield, I know that for sure, Dragon Fire, that's going to be my tank shield, I don't think I'm going to be using a Defender anymore, 8.4 mil, I will get an Ancient Wyvern shield eventually, uh, do I want Eternal shoes? How much do they cost? Eternal boots. Yep, I think I'm going to get those. Now I want the dragon crossbow as well, which is about 10 mil right now, I think. Dragon crossbow. Yeah, it's about 10.5 mil. Let's put it in for 10.6. Okay, I bought for, bought for about that much. Uh, 1,500. And now I'm also going to get myself a fury, I think. I wanted to get myself a mage book, but I just can't afford it yet. I want to do a mage book and uh, DFS switch, but I just can't afford it, so I'm gonna go for the Fury, and then our next upgrade after that can be the Mage's Book. So we just spent three mil on the Fury. We've just spent a lot of money. I also need to buy the Opal Dragon Bolts for this uh, crossbow. So let's go buy that real quick. Opal Dragon Bolt, oh, we need the Enchanted versions. Opal Dragon Bolt E. Get a couple hundred of those. And I still wanna get my Tentacle Whip back. I don't know if I can afford it with this money, I will have to actually sell some stuff to buy the tent whip as well, like my mystics and stuff. Okay, about 3.5 mil cash check. So a Kraken is just about 1 mil. I'll try buying it for that. And then we have 2.3 mil to buy this whip with. We're really cutting it close, huh? 397k. Does it buy? It just about buys. We have 37k cash left. Obviously, I have some stuff I can sell, like bolts I'm not using anymore, etc. So I'm going to sell that, get my cash check up a little bit. And we're going to go PKing. Catch this, right? Oh my god, I splashed? No way am I splashing. Come on, catch this, catch this, catch this. He's going to get gap on me. Okay, we caught it. Nice. Let's put a bolt in. Okay, there's a dwarf there. I need to be careful. Let's just go for the spec. Dead? Okay, we need to freeze that dwarf. We need to freeze it. Please, catch. Nice. He just got smited in that hit as well. He's going to be spamming that logout button. I got to I gotta spam click him. Okay, nice. Let's just go for the spec. Dead? 57 for the KO. Good fight. Boom. Nice. Oh, it wasn't even my loot. What the fuck? Okay, I guess I'm just going to have to wait here for the loot, I guess. The loot has successfully appeared. Any plus one? Unfortunately, lot. I thought he was smited for a second there. Good fight, man. How the neat's not full. Mystics, everything. GG. How many bolts did he have? 45. Let's just get all this on the looting bag. I really don't want to be still using a looting bag because of how much I'm risking. I'd honestly rather being a brew. But I know you guys are just going to complain in the comments, you know, saying, you know, you got to make the money, you got to bring the looting bag. So I'm, I'm doing it for you, all right? So if I die for everything, I blame you guys. Successfully got out of there with 600k loot. Good fight. What is he up to? What is he genuinely up to? Let's go and dump a spec in real quick. Is he going to go do his uh, imbued cape? I'm just going to double spec him. I hit a zero with a second spec for whatever reason. I don't think this guy has to run too far south until I can stop hitting him. He only needs to run like 30 levels, I'm pretty sure. Is he just not gonna- I feel like he's unfrozen by now. Is he, is he trying to make me into multi? <gasps> the skeleton. The skeleton. 
Not like this. Not like this. Freeze him. This might actually be a multi bait. Like, I'm not even trolling either. I gotta be careful. I don't even know where the multi lines are here. I know they're a little bit east, but apart from that, that's pretty much my knowledge. How many levels can I attack this guy for? I think only like until 29, so I have to kill him quick. Come on. I'm hitting I'm hitting zeros. He's got Moon Clan. He's got Moon Clan on. I better catch this instant. Oh my god, I misclicked a thousand times. Is he TB'd? Does he not have a telly? Whip him. Okay, good fight. I think we just got him at level 30, so we're lucky. Yeah, he was gonna go do his thingy majiggy. His um Mage Cape 2. 700 blood runes. How many lava runes did he have? I just got 3k lava runes and a far seer helm. Probably quite a few air runes as well. We actually just made bank of, what, 700 blood runes? Don't mind if I fucking do. And all these brews I can get in my looting bag as well. Sick. All right. On top of the 700 blood runes, we also have 200k in the looting bag just from supplies and the far seer helm, stuff like that. Let's bolt him. Get a bolt off. He's gonna run. Uh, is he in range? If I ranged him, I'm pretty sure I can catch a freeze, right? I should be able to at least. There we go. Uh, should we just dump a spec? Oh, he's my target as well. That's perfect. I mean, it's not perfect that I'm hitting uh, threes with my specs, but the fact he's my target in general is perfect. Because if he goes to, like, uh, Ankus and doesn't skip me, I'm pretty sure I can hit him the whole way there. Catch a freeze. I'm just going to go for a spec there. He's venomed as well. No anti-venom. 70. Did I just smite him? Did I just smite him? This wasn't my loot. Oh my god, I actually smited him as well. And it wasn't my loot, dude. I have to wait here. Who knows what that plus one could have been. Maybe he double clicked his prayers, but I don't really know, dude. I have to I have to stay here and just try and get that loot. <gasps> oh, it's a Bandos God Sword. I thought that was an AGS. I actually just had... Isn't that 10 mil still? I think I just PK'd 10 mil. I legit just had the biggest nerdgasm ever because I thought it was an AGS. Holy fuck, dude. Let's get that all in the looting bag. I actually get a BGS. What is that? 12 mil. Oh my god. He had double loot on him. That's why it wasn't my loot. He killed someone. That makes sense. Jesus. I just smited the BGS and it wasn't even my loot. 12 mil. Holy fuck. Oh my goodness. I cannot complain with that at all. Leave a like for that fucking smite. Holy shit. I'm sorry I just like nerdgasm like a little girl, but come on, man. I thought that was an EGS. A BGS is still very nice, so you know what? I don't even have to apologize. Alright, I just realized I banked my glory, so I'm actually gonna have to run down. So I thought I'd do it in a PvP world and not the Bounty Hunter world. Our first smite of the series being a BGS, it is now like 12 mil because of Warcraft or whatever. I don't really know why people use it so much. Our first smite, 13 mil, bank loot. Good fight. Let's get out of here. Right, with that BGS smite, we now have a lot more money, which means we can get a couple more upgrades. So what does that sell for? 12 mil? We're gonna get ourselves a mages book. Now I do eventually how much is it gonna buy for? Seven eight hundred K? Don't wanna be spending too much on it. I wanna save some money. Alright, nice. I do eventually wanna upgrade to the ancient wyvern shield, which is basically a mages book and a DFS in one. Has the offensive bonuses and the defensive bonuses, so I don't won't I won't have to do a shield switch. But it is 32 mil, so it's I need to sell the DFS and Mages Book and then make 15 mil on top of that. And yeah, that's going to be a while away. I also want to get the ACB, so I don't know what order I'm going to get all these upgrades in. I also want to get a B-Ring eventually. I can afford that right now with 5 mil, but I think I'm just going to hold off on it for now. Just PK in this, see how it goes, and uh, yeah, let's continue PKing. We've now got ourselves a Mage's Book. What is this? What is this, dude? It's Sal Rose Warrior in World 92. I was just telling up in the PvP world. It would be a hop no? What? Let's just go for the spec while he doesn't have his prayer on. 48? Should I just... Okay, nah, he's put his, up his prayers. I was about to double spec him. But I've, I've decided against it. Looks like he's a Rev Speaker by the bracelet. I was really not expecting to find anyone here. Okay, he's Venom. Probably doesn't have an Anti-Venom. He's got the Entangles. Dude, I have to be able to catch a freeze on this guy, right? He's got Entangles. DD under him real quick. Put a ball in. Uh, he's gonna pray melee, probably. Do I want to go in with this whip? I feel like I do. Put a lot of damage in. Just make him brew down so he can't really fight us back. The only way he really escapes is if, obviously, he goes to KBD. I'm not gonna go inside there, even though I can't attack him. Or he runs south. Freeze him. Oh my god, no. The clicks. The clicks are terrible. There's no way I splash on this, bro, in my mage bonus. Okay, there we go. Nice. He has a little bit to go. 
Just going for the AGS there. Dead. I can do so much damage in five levels, right? I hope so, at least. Noob? I don't think I'm a noob. I think I got some overpowered gear, which makes you the noob, doesn't it? Put a bolt in. The venom is kicking in. 39 for the KO. Good fight. I bent my looting bag just because I want to bring extra brews. He's just laughing at the amount of damage I've been able to do. GG, dude. Holy crap. Let's, uh... Pick up all the stuff, Mystic Mud stuff as well, Spirit Shield. Not bad loot, GG, dude. Alright, obviously no looting bags, so we can't loot everything, like all the potions and stuff. But we still got a Glory and Mystic Mud stuff. Helminate's not. The Bracelet, which is another 40k, so like 400k loot. Good fight, man. OP gear. It's pure shit. Oh my god, it's the guy who killed me at the start of the series. Dad? I'm sorry, bro. Change your prayers? Ah. Come on, catch a big freeze there. I know he uses a Ballista, I'm pretty sure. Going for another big freeze there? Oh, another zero. Yeah, he's got the ballista. I gotta be careful of that. That shit hits hard. He almost killed me earlier, yesterday, with like a claws to ballista combo. Come on, give me a big freeze. Damn. He's gonna be brewing down a lot, obviously, because of the damage I do. So he's probably gonna use that ballista more than anything. Catch another freeze there. He's probably gonna pray mage now. Oh, still zero bolt on the ropes. Interesting. That's a big bolt. Change your prayers, please. Oh, imagine if you change them. That's unfortunate. Pray range there. I don't want to take too big of a ballista hit. Is that a refreeze? It's not as well. Dude, Jesus Christ. Well, that happened. I know most of you are probably writing your comments, oh my god, why didn't you pray melee? Why didn't you put your tank on? Well, to be honest, I just fucking panicked. I got clawed to 34. I did I didn't I expected him to be frozen so I could run away. I didn't expect him to hit that high in the first place. I just panicked, and after the first claw, I did go to pray melee, as you guys saw, but I thought he was going to pull out the ballista after he saw I went back to pray melee. So I prayed range preemptively, thinking he was going to ballista me, and he just double claws me for the HP I had left. I didn't put on my tank, because like I said, I just panicked, and we've just lost 54 mil. So if you guys did enjoy the video, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, feel free to call me an idiot in the comments. We're back on the rebuild tomorrow. I'm so sorry for losing everything.